Good morning, everyone, and welcome to the Starseed Dragon channel. Let me just see if I can... Oh, nope. Going that way. Okay. Let me make sure I get all the cards in there. Good morning. This is our daily perspective for today. We're going to start off with the um, White Sage Tarot. And today we got the Two of Swords. And it says... Stalemate blocked emotions. The Two of Swords indicates a strong bond between you and another person. If you are, if there is a conflict, you are like battering rams. You can find balance if you both have some give and take. The green ribbon suggests focusing on your heart chakra for the solution. Chakra four. Heart center green light. So let's look at our chakra cards. Chakra four. Chakra four. Heart center green light. Transformation center air energy. Love others and yourself. Chakra four. Matters of the heart. Ooh, so we're heartfelt today. Hmm, good to know. And then we're going to go to my beloved dragon tarot. And today we got the Eight of Cups. Isn't he a beauty? Um, our guide dragon flies over a watery landscape following the path of a river back to its source. Divinitary meaning. Looking for something on a more meaningful basis. Let's see if I can get the light out of there. There we go. Isn't he pretty? Looking for something... On a more meaningful basis. Interesting. And then we're going to go over to the Dragon Tarot by Nigel Suckling. And today we got the Nine of Cups. And it says, Victory and success come your way as several long held dreams come true. Share your good luck with others and it will be multiplied. This is a good time for looking forward and making fresh plans for the future because your confidence will be infectious. Uh, several new and stimulating friends are likely to enter your life. Beautiful. That's a great message. I like to know I'm going to make friends today. I like to think that. And then we're going to go over to the Whispers of Love Oracle. It is beauty. It's number 53, Love Endures. I hope you can see all of that. It's a giant card. Love Endures. Love does not give up or lose faith. Love is hopeful and withstands every situation. No matter what is going on, love can endure all things. Take positive steps to help create the change that is necessary to get you through this. Release your fear and recognize that this love will last. Take a step back so you are better able to remember this truth. Love lasts. When differences arise, it is important to accept the person you are with as their own perspective. Um, as their own perspective. Learn to compromise. Avoid taking a hard stand when it is not necessary. Be aware of what you want in your relationships so things can return to a state of harmony. There are many things beyond your control, but you can control how you feel. At times, it feels easier to walk away from a relationship, especially if it feels tedious or demanding. Look at what you have done uh, when faced with challenges in your relationships, do you give in to get through the conflict or do you take a stand? Look at your past reactions and be willing to address any behaviors or aspects of yourself that are um, of no benefit to you. A young couple sit close to each other as the boat they are traveling on encounters turbulent seas. The lion at the mast of the ship represents personal power. Turbulent water symbolizes high emotions. Taking a minute to compose yourself 
and your thoughts benefits everyone. Are you asserting yourself in a loving manner? Take love or make love the driving force. Return to its energy. Return to this energy to support your <clears throat> return to this energy to support you through whatever is going on. Apparently, I need more coffee. Beautiful. I'm going to take a sip of my coffee. Okay, and now we're going to go over to our um, wild unknown animal spirit. And today we got the beautiful fox, which is an earth element. And it says, smart, strong partner or mate, wise teacher. The fox is an enchanting creature with plenty of mystique to go around. Fox personalities are skillful in business and also make great teachers. They are quick to learn and adapt well to new situations. Foxes are ideal life partners as they commit to relationships for the long term and their natural charisma keeps things exciting. Fox energy helps us stay true to those most dear to us when this card appears. Reconnect to those you love. Foxes don't do well when they slip away. Balance or when in balance, magical, ingenious teacher, mag, uh, magnanimous. Uh, when out of balance, sneaky, unsure of their identity, to bring into balance partnership and connection. He's a beauty. Partnership and connection. And then we will go to our last card uh, from the Believe in Your Own Magic Oracle deck. And today we got number two, Evil Queen. You deserve sugar, not salt. Someone in your life is mistreating you. You keep trying to see the good in them, but they just keep disappointing you again and again. Truth is, some people don't deserve second chances. As difficult as it may be, this is your sign that you need to cut them loose. Unfollow them and block their number. It's time to move on. Do whatever it takes to find some inner peace, for it's just as precious as gold. Beautiful. We do deserve sugar instead of salt, right? What lovely messages we got today. I hope that something um, in today's perspective sang to you and you take it into your day and make it the best day ever. And um, I will see you tomorrow. Have a great day.